Yeah, sure. So I think there's uh, three high impact um, abstracts being presented on this meeting with, with Epernetapa. Um, specifically to the triplet, the true complete remission rate um, was near 40%, which is higher than HMA venetoclax uh, alone. Um, the P53 group is a very sick group of patients and whether or not there's subsets that can better respond or not, I think is an open question. How do these patients do to transplant? I think the importance of the triplet is it was overall safe and again with overall um, favorable response rates. I think what's the durability of response and the overall survival um, as the cohort matures is a really important consideration. I think separately we show in a combined large phase two trial uh, with the GFM and our center that uh, complete remissions are very good with the combination of epinetapopt and azacitidine therapy alone. And particularly if we get patients that have deep molecular remissions and go to transplant, we actually had a median overall survival that was not met and this is a molecular group of patients that has very poor outcomes uh, to transplant, even with some centers arguing whether or not transplant should occur. And on that note, actually, Dr. Mishra at this meeting will be presenting post-transplant maintenance of that combination um, with a, uh, an overall survival that has not been met with decently long-term follow-up. So can we use a novel combination, get the best remission, take them to transplant, and then give them maintenance? Maybe an, ultimate, or an optimal paradigm for patients with P53 mutant disease.